Hello and welcome to the solution video to spicy question number 5. In this question we've been given an algebraic ratio and told it's equivalent to 3 to 4. What I'm going to do is take 4 lots of the left part of the ratio, so 4 lots of the x squared plus 4x. And I'm going to write this as equal to 3 lots of the right hand side of the ratio, so 3 lots of 3x plus 5. Now why can I write this down? Well x squared plus 4x represents 3 parts of the ratio. And if I take 4 of those, I've got 12 parts, because 4 times 3 equals 12. So the left hand side here is representing 12 parts. Now on the right hand side I have 3 lots of 3x plus 5. And 3x plus 5 is represented by 4 parts in the ratio. So I have 3 lots of 4 parts, which is again 12 parts. Now we can just use algebra to solve this equation. If we expand the left hand side we get 4x squared plus 16x. And expanding the right hand side is 9x plus 15. If we now get all of the terms on the left, so subtract 9x and 15 from both sides, we get 4x squared plus 7x minus 15 equals 0. This is a quadratic equation, so you could use the formula, but this one also factorises. It would factorise to give 4x minus 5 and x plus 3 equals 0. We get two solutions from this, so either 4x minus 5 equals 0, which gives you x equals 1.25 or 5 over 4, and the other bracket is x plus 3 equals 0, which gives x equals negative 3. But we were told in the question that x is greater than 0, so we only want one of those solutions. So the answer to the question is x equals 1.25. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you found it useful. Check out the video I think you should watch next and subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos.